Almost every medical treatment, diagnosis or prevention of a disease has its roots in medical science. Many of these scientists never see patients, but they spend long hours in laboratories unraveling the secrets of disease. The CSIR's Dr. Makobe Tsakati is a molecular pathologist who focuses on the diagnosis of disease through the examination of molecules in organs, tissue and fluids. I am a molecular pathologist. A molecular pathologist look at diseases at a molecular level with a view of understanding on how diseases manifest themselves with a view of developing ways to prevent, treat and diagnose the specific diseases. A molecular pathologist work at different projects but at the CSIR we are focused at developing a point of care TB diagnostics. That means diagnosing TB without the need for a laboratory. The second project, we are involved in developing a way of preventing mother-to-child transmission of HIV during breastfeeding. And the other project that we are involved in is to develop a microbicide of preventing the transmission of HIV in women. I'm a head of the Emerging Health Technologies Department, which includes the Aptama Technology Group. Aptamas are artificial nucleic acid molecules similar to antibody in function. They can be developed to bind to various target molecules with high sensitivity and specificity. And they have application in diagnostics, targeted drug delivery, therapeutics, as well as uh, prophylactics. They can also be used just as analytical tools for research. A molecular pathologist is a subspeciality of the medical sciences and they focus mostly in working in the lab. So they are very important in that they try and find answers to some of the important research questions or priority diseases. And once they find those answers, then they will develop a product which can be uh, translated for, for clinical use uh, in, in consultation or collaboration with clinicians. Molecular pathologists are important because they complement the, the medical uh, fraternity. Their main role is to look at diseases in, in the lab and also to develop products that can be uh, translated for, for clinical use in consultation with uh, clinicians. A, a typical molecular pathologist will be somebody who has passion for science, has passion, is analytical, and is imaginative. To qualify as a molecular pathologist, you can either do a degree that makes you to become a doctor and after that specialize, or you do a basic science degree to take in medical sciences courses such as biochemistry, molecular medicine, microbiology, and after that you do a master's, a PhD, and postdoctoral training. Uh, what I enjoy about the CSIR is it provides a mix of academic and, and industry environment. It also provides a multidisciplinary research environment, great infrastructure, uh, good support structures, uh, good career growth and prospects, as well as a great campus.